Okay. So we looked in this box between cuts. The box of mystery. And we found out that we have this little maze here. Uh, each of these records has a an arrow on it. So we must have to move in that direction. So I'll take these. You take the other ones. All right. And with this, we'll kind of just go with what we have. So I have one that goes forward. Let's use I'd it. I put that one on in there. I don't know how this works. Here, let me try this. Take yours out. Do you have one that moves um, up and to the right? Yeah. Play that one. Not well that sure. Well let's wait. Let's wait and see if it finishes. Don't forget we can always use a hint. Oh yeah. How do we do that? It's in the book. I don't have the book, so I don't have the book either. Neither of us have a book. Okay. Well then we can't use hints. Yay. I think it got rid of our book when we teleported. Or when we logged off. Doesn't, no. It keeps your inventory. <laughs> That's true. When you log into <clears throat> realms, does it go away? No. Hint. Nah, it doesn't work. Didn't think it would work. Slash hint. Unknown command. Hmm. I don't understand what we're doing. Reset. Oh, now we have a book. That's better. Here, I'll do a hint. No, wait, 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 wait. Okay, yeah, go ahead, right hint. Maybe it'll work for me this time. Each room has two doorways. The arrows in the disc name show the direction of these doors. Pressing the button will reset the puzzle. Good luck. The discs make rooms. Each room has two doorways. The arrow in the disc names show the direction of these doors. By pressing the button, we'll reset the puzzle. Oh, so we need to figure out which doorway is in each one. Or what direction the doors are. Um, this one clearly has to be up. No, it has two doorways. No. Hang on, I'm just going to try each one. There we go. You want quartz? We got quartz. Collect that stuff. I don't know if we need this stuff or not. Wait, what? Or maybe this is just bogus crap. Why do we there's, want quartz? There's some levers. Yeah, but we can't place them on anything. One block of quartz equals one emerald. Well, we don't have an emerald block, so this must be something that you collect later. Lower year prices. Lower prices now at... Huh, okay. Back to the overhead. Wait, 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 wait. We gotta... I can't see what's in the room. Okay. 
So let's try... Maybe it's the way the door is facing and the way you need to move. So look for... Do I have one that's a left and right? All the names changed back. Well, some of them did. Here I have a left and right. I have three that aren't named anymore. Okay, put it in. I did it and do it in. Alright, move then. Move. Alright, well I'm a lot of discs. Put all yours in. You draw the same ones. Nothing. Make sure you're facing north when judging the arrows. The map helps. Mm. North. So, do you have one facing right? You can also press F3 and look which way is north. Um, I don't know. My things all lost their name with the exception of one. Yeah, so did mine. Well, that's obnoxious. Maybe it's supposed to do that. Maybe you're only allowed to use one. I have three that have their name. I have one, two... Mine are all music discs with the exception of one. Mine... two of mine have names. Is it a white one that has a name for you? Mine's like purple and white. Oh. Um... Is there a reset button in here? All the way back here. Okay, well, which one is this one? The blue one. Okay. So, let, let me see if I can figure this out based on the first. Which one did they use? Alright, hold on. See what area they go to? Put, put the purple disc in there. The first one? Yeah, Mela, hi, whatever it is. The disc you're holding right now, put it in there. Oh. Now I'm going to put a white disc in here. Okay. All right. All right. We found it, I think. Okay. So I cut <laughs> to this part here is what I'll do. So okay. then we need the green and yellow one. Do you have that one? Yep. And then the purple one again. That was really stupid. Yeah, that was confusing. And then white. I have white. And then purple again. Yeah, that was dumb. That it could bring us to an area that dead ends, and then not really tell us that it dead ends. Yeah, white. And now the blue, blue one. Now the yellow green one. Yellow white. Whatever it is. Purple again. So these rooms just don't mean anything. Red. I only have one red. Do you have another red? Do you have yeah, red? Yeah. Okay, good. And the other red. And then the white. Okay, that was confusing. To say the least. Okay, turn your notebook volume back up now. The danger has passed. Here's a freebie hint. Move mobs to the other side. Careful with those fences. They look weak. Okay. So we can place these... Uh, these stained glass can break stained glass. That's what these are made for. Alright, so we have to get... Select villager, select zombie. Hmm? Where does it say that? You no. hover over him. Transfer reset. Place selection here. Oh, I have no more. Wait, what? Oh! I killed one. And that button up there is gone. Wait, what? Oh, and I have my shit back. Okay, hold on. 
So we have to get the mobs separated. But how? How, how, how? How now, brown cow? We can only place these on blocks of gold. Okay, so... Let's just do that. Push the... Now what happens? Nothing. Push the yellow button. Wait, this is green now. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And you, we, we moved one. Oh. Now what? Put green there and push it again? Oh, it's moving back. So we have to do a find this. Maybe if we, Hold on. No, we have to separate them, though. What do the lights mean? I don't know. Transfers up top, resets on the bottom. Okay, let me try brown on the bottom, then. And the zombie's moving. Why does the zombie move every single time? The zombie didn't move. Three villagers, two zombies. Okay. Let's try zombie on the top. Let's put two... yeah. Okay, so I moved him over there. I don't really know what we're doing, to be honest. Yeah, I'm not that sure what the goal is. Now let's try both. I just want to try one more green on the top. No, that moved it back. Okay. I'm not really sure how this works, but... Let's try green on the top again, should bring him back over. I think this bar thing moves guys around. So, what this means is somebody's gonna be moving- Oh! Now put brown. And now nobody's gonna move. Cause there's no brown here. Oh! Okay, I figured this out, I figured this out. This bar here Mm -hmm. Somebody has to move every time. Whichever side's longer is the direction they're going to move in. So what we need to do is bring a villager and a zombie each time and bring a villager back each time. Mm. So we have to bring the zombie back. I just figured that out. I'm bringing sexy back. No. I will destroy your family. You are my family. Then I will destroy us all. Okay. Now... I put a green and a brown. So now a villager and a zombie are going to move. Okay, now put a brown in. Oh, snap. No, villager buddy. And now we can just bring a zombie over. But do it quick. Go place green now before they break the fence. I don't have any green. Okay, now do it. Top or bottom? Doesn't matter. Just place it. It doesn't matter where it goes. That should bring the zombie over. And this should unlock it. Yeah! No. What? We separated the two. Now what? Here's a freebie hit. Move the mobs to the other side. Oh, move both, all of the mobs to the other side. Mm. Oh, I thought we were separating them. Okay, start over. But we have to be careful with the fences, they look weak. Which means they can break down the fences and kill the villagers. Hang on a sec. At no point can the zombies outnumber the villagers on any given side. You must transport at least one mob. And not more than two. Okay. Okay. So if the zombies outnumber the villagers, the villagers die. So you have to keep them balanced. Right. Okay. So let's move. Or no. That move both at once. Yep. Okay. You have to keep villagers higher than zombies or keep them at the same level. You can't keep them higher. There's three and three. So no matter what happens, one of the sides is going to get broken. 
Oh, yeah. So now we have to transfer a villager over to this side. Right, right, right. right. Okay. Okay. Now a villager. And a zombie again. And a zombie, and then quickly a villager. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Now two villagers. Wait. No, that can't work. No, that's not gonna work. Um. Can we move? Hang on. Let's just move a zombie. And then who's gonna come back? Another zombie? No, watch. You move one. Just trust me on this. No. You move Trust a zombie, me. somebody has to come back over. Not necessarily. Yes, necessarily. No. Yes. No. You have to move a mob. Every right. time. Move move it this zombie. Over here. Over here. Right. Who has to come back over here? A zombie. Nobody. That's yes. not that's not a rule. Yes, it is a rule. No, it's not. Oops, wrong one. You must transport at least one mob. Press T. Look, we transported one mob from this side to that side. Right. Who's going back? Oh, I see what you're saying. Thank you. Now we have to bring a zombie back, because this doesn't do anything. I thought you meant we physically couldn't do it in the first place. No. Meaning it's not going to do anything. Mm. Okay. Where is it? We have to move a... Move two villagers over here. A villager back. Villager and a zombie. And then just a... Then a zombie back and a zombie, a zombie, and, a zombie and a villager and a zombie. Okay, move two villagers. We got this. Oh, wait, but now aren't they gonna eat this guy? Oh, shoot. Yeah, they will. Go fast. No, villager... Oh, no, it's not gonna matter. Shit. All right, restart. Um. Hmm. I moved two vil. Wait a minute. Start off with two zombies. Didn't we just reset this? Yeah. There we go. Here, start off by moving two zombies. There's only. Oh, they're in each other. What the? The what? No. Then move a, a zombie. Move a zombie back. Then, then two villagers. Move. Villager back. Villager and a zombie. That's what you have to do. Mm-hmm. We got it. Now two villagers. No, nope, because then these guys are going to eat this guy. Oh, shit. But if we bring a villager and a zombie over, then that they, they eat this guy. So you lose either way. All you're gonna do is bring... You have to start all over. Um... I hate that there's three of them. Because you can't leave them alone. Um... Ooh, I have an idea. I could jump in there. What? And now they're gonna eat this. Okay, two zombies. And now a zombie comes back. Clearly. Right, so move a zombie back. Oh, I just finished my sandwich.